You just can't drive in Atlanta without seeing someone on the side of the road answering for their sins. Speeders keep Atlanta police very busy. Because police officers here write tickets on a very consistent basis. He should know Jackie Patterson is a former police officer, a former police chief, and he works both sides of the traffic court bench. He's been representing drivers for 15 years, and he's a judge. I'm also a traffic court judge in the city of Greenville, Georgia, part-time. That makes him the go-to guy on a story about the age-old myths surrounding traffic tickets, like our first one. If you get a ticket in another state, it won't be recorded on your Georgia driving record. That's false. If you have a Georgia license, but you get a, you get a ticket in Texas, for an example, then they're going to report that back to Georgia once you either pay the fine in, in Texas or get found guilty, and it shows up on your Georgia record. Myth number two, a police officer can pull you over for simply not wearing your seatbelt. True. Most certainly. Uh, that is the law in Georgia. You have to have a seatbelt on if you're driving an automobile. The only exception if the vehicle is many, many years old and it's exempted from the seatbelt law. Myth number three, it's possible to keep a traffic ticket from showing up on your driving record. True if you know the magic number. If you get convicted of doing more than 14 miles over the speed limit in Georgia, it automatically goes on your driving record. So the way I defend people is that I'm able to, to talk to the officer, to the prosecutor, and get it reduced to 14 miles or less, and it doesn't get reported to your Georgia driver's record. So the magic number is 14 miles over the speed limit, but parents, listen up. If your teenager is caught driving more than 24 miles over the speed limit, his driving days are over. Then he's going to get a letter in the mail that says his license is suspended for six months because it's a mandatory suspension. And that means your son can't get a permit to drive. It's impossible. And finally, myth number four, an officer must have a radar or laser gun to give you a ticket. False. Here's why. They can do it by visualization. The law allows an officer to say, based upon my training and experience, he was doing 55 in a 30 mile per hour zone. That's enough for a conviction in Georgia, even without radar or laser.